Josh's Order Corner. That's me. Sure is loud down here today, but we're going to power through it. We're going to power through it. I need to stop ordering books because as you'll see, there's this stack right here. This cupboard here, like all this, that's full of books. And I have a shelf over here of my read these next, fucker, stop looking for old books shelf. Um... So I got a couple books in today. One is signed. I think this is actually from Amazon. And since it was from like an independent seller, it shipped like this. So this might not be something worth us talking about, but we're gonna find out because that's what we do here on Josh's Order Corner. Let's open shit up. Yeah, this is, uh, I almost ordered this from, I don't remember who, I saw it was on sale. But then I found it for cheaper, and I didn't know if I would love it. I also looked for a signed copy of it, but, you know, didn't happen. Confessions of a Puppet Master, a Hollywood memoir of ghouls, guts, and gonzo filmmaking. Renowned producer, director, and B-movie showman Charles Band takes readers on a wild romp through Hollywood's decidedly un-Oscar-worthy underbelly, where mayhem and zombies reign supreme and cheap thrills and entertainment are king. So there's that. That's uh, a little intro to it. It says, zombies, aliens, a little skin, lots of gore, and even more laughs. The cinematic universe of Charles Band is legendary. From the toilet invading creatures of ghoulies to the time-traveling bounty hunter and trancers to the pandemic crash corona zombies, Band has spent four decades giving B-movie lovers exactly what they love. In Confessions of a Puppet Master, this congenial master of grindhouse cinema tells his own story uncut. Born into a family of artists, Band spent much of his childhood in Rome, where his father worked in the film industry. Early visits to movie sets sealed young Charlie's fate. By his 20s, he had plunged into movie making himself, but found his calling in exploitation movies. Quick low-budget efforts that exploit the zeitgeist and feed people's desire for clever, lowbrow entertainment. His films cross genres from vampire flicks to sci-fi to erotic musical adaptations of fairy tales. As he came into his own as a director, he was given, uh, he was the first to give starring roles to super soon-to-be household names like Demi Moore, Helen Hunt, and Bill Maher. Offset, Band's life was equally epic. Returning to his beloved Italy, he bought both Dino De Laurentiis movie studio and a medieval castle. After Romania's oppressive communist regime fell, he circumvented the U.S. State Department to shoot films in Dracula's homeland. He made, and then lost, a movie-making fortune. A visionary. Band was also at the vanguard of the transition to home video and streaming, making and distributing direct-to-video movies long before major, major studios caught on. In this revealing tell-all, Band details the dizzying heights and catastrophic depths of his four decades in showbiz, a candid and engaging glimpse at Hollywood's wild side. Confessions of a Puppet Master is as entertaining as the movies that make the consummate Schlockmeister famous. Renowned producer, director, mogul, B-movie showman, he has directed or produced more than 360 films, including The Ghoulies and Tourist Trap, one of Stephen King's favorite horror movies. He lives in L.A. That's cool. I have Tourist Trap upstairs. I have yet to read it. Uh, but yeah, this came across my feed, and I decided I wanted to check it out. Uh, so we're gonna. We're gonna. But, of course, I have something signed as well, and that is this right here. Coming from Livonia, Michigan, which... Uh, is not Detroit, but it's in Michigan, so it's closer to Detroit than I am. And we're going to say that it is the Rock City. What am I doing here? How do I open this? Uh, this is from Rock City Music Co. I ordered this like Thursday, I think, after jumping around the internet a little bit. I was curious about this book. I don't know exactly what to expect, but I found this awesome deal frats based on true events by d snyder and it is paperback special edition 
signed by D. Snyder, Uncle Ed's favorite rocker. And on the back here, it's special edition event soft cover for the event they had at their shop, Rock City, number 151 out of 225. That's why I ordered it. I love that it was signed. I love that it was a special edition. Based on true events, when young Bobby Kovacs unexpectedly moves with his parents to Baldwin, Long Island, the high school hallways of 1972 proved to be littered with boys of all shapes and sizes, desperate for one thing and one thing only, to belong. As he ventures even deeper into the jungle of battling brotherhoods or self-proclaimed frats, hazing ceremonies, broken promises, and his own sense of self lead Bobby down the dark path of joining forces with what he fears the most in order to go on. Uh, what he fears the most in order to go on. Comma would have been good there. But how far will he go and who is he willing to hurt as he fights to survive? If you are looking for a daring, disturbingly honest story that examines the pressures of toxic masculinity in the high school hallways, look no, for, look no further. D. Snyder is an American singer, songwriter, radio personality, writer, and actor. Frats is D's first novel. These frats. I was in a fraternity in college. Uh, it was a awesome experience, to be honest with you. Uh, I never had a group of people who had my back the way some of those guys did. Um, but that's a conversation for a whole other time. Frats by D. Snyder. Signed copy. Special edition from Rock City. I'll put a link to their shop down below uh, so you can find this book if you are interested in that numbered edition. And I really got to get moving on some of the books I'm reading. Like right now, I'm finishing Savage Mountain by John Quick. It's so far a really good read. I just haven't had the time to put into it. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to get off here. I'm going to read my book and then move on to the next book and 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 the next book. And do, 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 do,